you were actually called and polled by these people that say Democrats aren't excited this year. How many of you were polled? Raise your hand if you dare. One person. Anybody else? Are you excited about this race? Yeah. Are you excited about electing some great Democrats to office? Yeah. Let me tell you something. I have traveled all over the state of Texas, and I have never seen as much excitement about any race, about any of the Democrats. Everybody is excited about getting to where we need to get, and that is to retire Rick Perry and David Dukers. And the only way to do that is to get our people out to vote. The only way to do that is to tell them that we need somebody with real leadership in the governor's office. We need somebody with real leadership in the Senate. And as Lieutenant Governor, I promise you that I will be the voice of all Texans here out of San Antonio for you all across the state of Texas. It is a very sad state of affairs that we have in Texas where our educational system is failing us, not because we don't have some great teachers, and certainly not because we shouldn't be paying them more money, but because David Dukehurst and Rick Perry have done a very poor job in Texas. All they have been about is themselves. They don't care about average working Texans. Now, I will have to tell you this, and I know you're going to boo me, so go ahead and boo me, but, and it's okay. I am going to have to agree with one thing with Rick Perry. I knew you were going to boot. I prepared myself for that. Rick Perry announced about a week and a half ago about all of the jobs that he has created for Texas. No, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's true. He has created a lot of jobs for Texas. He has brought a lot of these Fortune 500 companies to Texas. That's also true. But guess what? When he brought them, he told them, all you have to pay is minimum wage jobs. Texas is the number one state in the nation with the most minimum wage jobs. Rick Perry and David Dewhurst have sold us down the river. So that's why I agree with Perry. He has created a lot of jobs but there's jobs where you have to actually have two of them to make ends meet. Now let me ask you something. How many of you here know somebody that holds down two jobs to make ends meet? How many of you can afford to send your children to college? Raise your hand. One, maybe two. That's a comparison that we cannot live with. I have worked all my life to build on people's salaries, to build a better life for them and their families, to represent them whether it comes to civil rights, human rights, women rights, LGBT rights, every kind of rights, every kind of rights that everybody has. And yet, in the last 16 years of Republican rule, I have seen it go down the toilet. Well, let me tell you something, somebody asked me, a little while ago, if I was ready to kick some Republican, I said no. I said no, I'm going to be kicking some Republican como se llama, okay? And that's simply because we need to get them out of Austin, we need to clean house, and you are the power behind the vote. You're going to have to get us there, and all I can say to you is, I will be your voice when I am the next Lieutenant Governor of the State of Texas. Thank you!